Hey everybody, it's Michael. I was just looking at how similar these guys are to 40k Space Marines, but I'm sure it's not a problem. Anyway, we're back for episode 7 of Ogre here, turning the tables. A convoy has been stealing data from us, has, uh, is trying to escape over the sea, so we got to stop them. And boy, this is a doozy of a mission. We gotta be fast, and yet we gotta hit hard. We're gonna have ogres coming in from up here, and they're gonna be trying to get to an ocean hex, and the minute they do that, we lose the game. So we have a couple of deployment zones. We click here, we can see they're off here on the right and off here on the left. We need to quickly engage some ogres and shut them down if at all possible. Now, problem is really one of uh, speed and firepower. I think the first goal I think what I'm going to try to do is use a number of GEVs and intercept, if I can, while getting some heavier stuff to come this way, maybe head to these two cities here, and then hopefully, um, you know, be able to stop the next wave. There's going to be a few waves of ogres coming on. We've got a destroyer to disable all of them. None of them can reach the sea, and we can't lose our entire force, of course. We're going to be getting eight GVs on turn five, chasing the, I guess, the final group, maybe, of ogres that are coming. So, what are we going to do here? Uh, I'm going to suggest that I go for four GVs there, four GVs there. How many did I get? I can't tell. It looks like just two. Yeah, there's four there. There's four more there. So that leaves it with seven points. That's not right, though. That's not even right. Let's check this out. Uh, what did I do here? No, there are four GVs there. And there are five there. Okay, yeah. So let's delete that one. Did that work? Hello, GV. Can I delete you? There you go. Okay, so I think we're down to... Or we're still looking at a full stack over here. Yeah, there they go. Okay, cool. Let's get back to deployment here. Okay, so that leaves us with eight points. And with those eight points, what do we want? Do we want missile tanks with a hit of three, range of four, super heavies, hit of six, range of three? I'm going to say super heavies. One, two, three, four. Head to that city there. These guys head to this city here. Is it actually better to have started them up here? They got to move a three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Take three turns to get in here. They can get there by the time those guys get down there, assuming they come down the middle. So you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually delete these. And I'm going to go back. And I'm going to drop them in right here and hope like heck they can get over there. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Let's do them there. Now infantry, where do we put those guys? I'm going to suggest that maybe we deploy them down here and use them as our final backup. I'm going to go for that. I'm going to take size three there and I'll put just I guess two down here maybe actually instead of deploying all the way down here let me just put them up here and we got one point left let's throw them there alright let's give this a go I don't have a lot of faith in this working but we'll, we'll see so here go our two mark ones the regular old mark ones one main battery four anti-personnel 18 treads so we're definitely gonna need to hit them hard now, hopefully my GEVs aren't completely crapified here. These guys have a range of how much on their main battery? I think it's three. Yeah, it's a range of three of attack of four. So, let me bring them down here. Oh, one more, please. Oh, no, I guess I got it. Okay, cool. And by the way, I want to thank Granite Penguin uh, in particular for all of the comments, but everybody for all the comments in general. The, um, they've all been very, very helpful in helping me figure out this game. I still don't see everything, but um, I'm working on it, working on trying to figure it out. See if we can roll through there. 
Um, and I, hopefully it's okay to say this, but I've been having a little, little bit of private chat with uh, Grand Penguin. I guess he's a uh, men in black for uh, for Steve Jackson Games, helping demo Ogre, and I didn't realize that. And that would be why he uh, knows the rules very well. I do have like the fancy designer's edition of Ogre that I got uh, out of the Kickstarter. Well, I, I wasn't part of the Kickstarter, but I bought it at a game store that had a couple copies. I've played it maybe twice. I love it. You know, I've played it by myself a little bit, but that's not exactly very challenging or conducive to learning the game. But uh, it's been really. It's. Uh, this is more than I've ever played the game, so anyway, yeah, learning a lot here. And I certainly don't catch everything, but I'm trying to. In particular, I think I haven't quite figured out, well I know I haven't quite figured out how, uh, we're not going to be firing this phase. Haven't quite figured out how all of these things interact, um, in terms of fire ability. Let's see, you're going to move three. Probably going to come through there. That'll put you in range of me, which I don't really want this turn. So, I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to creep him forward to here. And keep him out of the way. I don't think anybody will really get in range. I hope not. And then we'll rush him next turn. These guys here. Just bomb them over as far as they'll go. Hopefully we can get in here next turn. I've played this a couple times, tried a couple different strategies. I tried to hold them down here, that doesn't work. I tried to chase them, kind of start down here and come up here, that didn't work. So, still got a lot of figuring to do. Where could you go to? You could only go to there, which would, I'm pretty sure, put you in range of these guys. Let's let them do their move and see where they get to. Okay, so you're gonna come to there. Okay, they don't get to reach us, that's great. Let me just double check my remembrance here. We got a range of two, hit of two. So if we get to here, we should be able to hit them and then pull back out before we get hit. So let's try that. Actually, I'm just gonna make, uh, I wanna make sure that we can maybe pull back to the city here. So, Gotta move there at least, I guess, to even be able to hit him, so. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get out of his way on the, on the next turn, but. If we can take out his main battery, that would be sufficient. Now, these guys, I don't know if we're gonna be able to get them over in time. That is not in range. But I'll be able to get in range for the second move phase, which I don't actually want. Hmm. Where do I put them? One, two, three. Put them down here and possibly be out of range. I might go down here rather than have him. Hmm. Maybe that's not the best course of action. I'm not entirely sure. Um, Granny Ping was telling me something about. Uh, about overruns, right? So if you knock out their main battery, you basically get in there and get to take some shots at them, and then uh, they can't really do anything except like ram one of your vehicles. So if you overrun with several vehicles, then you're basically going to get a few free shots at them, which seems like a really good idea, but I'm not sure I know how to put it into play yet. We'll, we'll see. Once we get them on some more open ground, we'll try. We'll try the overrun thing with those GVs. Okay, I'm gonna move these super heavies. Can't get them in range this turn, but they could be in range for next turn. Let's pop the super heavies into the city here. And I'm gonna do the same with the infantry. I'm gonna bring them on into the city. 
Then I'll also put them on the road for some faster movement. I don't know when we're expecting more ogres at the moment. We still have one move left here. What about you? One, two, three. Yeah. But he's gonna move. In theory. Uh, you know what? This is probably stupid. I'm sure it is, in fact. But... I'm gonna try it. End phase there. Fire phase. We're gonna try to take out this guy's main battery. A one to two is the ratio. We get a six or better, we get the target destroyed. If we do that, we get a five or better target destroyed. Alright, I'll try it. Yeah, that didn't work. Let's add these two. Five or better. Can I just please have that? No, apparently not. Alright, so there goes probably a GED. Although... I'm not going to be able to pull him completely out of range. But I can pull him back. I certainly don't want to put him in range of two of them. And I don't think I want him sitting on top of each other. So there's no chance of spillover fire. Here's what I'm going to do. Let me spread them out. They've got enough mobility that we can reform them again. So I'm going to spread them out as much as I can over here. Alright, bring you there, and then this guy... Just going to bring him, I guess, back here. He won't be in range this turn. Alright, these guys are sitting ducks. We're going to lose a couple for sure. Okay, here come the new ones. Getting an overrun here, okay. Well, I'll try for that. It's not gonna work. Nope, okay, that didn't work. And now the GV is dead. Oh, I can, I got a ram. <coughs> Excuse me. Why would I ram though? It's going to do one damage, but he's just going to destroy me. He has a chance to not destroy me, though, so let's not do that. Let's let him do his firing, and then, of course, he'll destroy me. Yeah, yeah I didn't really think that would work out all that well, but, you know. Okay. That's a disabled by attack. They both went for the same guy, though, interestingly enough. Huh. Huh. Now that's rather interesting. Alright, I'm going to try to surround. Yeah, I'm going to try to surround this guy with the GVs. And actually, here is a good enough spot for him. Can reach that guy. And then I'm hoping to pull him back. Can't stack any more there. Let's bring him forward to here then. I totally did not do the uh, stacking or the uh, thing that I said I was going to do, did I? I think these super heavies are going to move up here and try to engage. They've got a range of three. That should put them in range right there. Let me hope. That with two of these guys, I can take out one of their one of their main batteries. Now, what do I do with these infantry? On up the road, I guess. I don't think they're going to be much use as a last ditch effort. So maybe I can put them in the city here and do something with them later. Okay, there's going to be no point. Is there any point to getting this infantry out of cover and up here? I don't believe there is. Um, where could you go? 
You could come over here and help with that, but we don't need you to do that. All right, that's it. Okay, main battery. Uh, okay, five or better. You know, I'm gonna go. I'm sorry. I'm, no, that, that's not gonna help, is it? All right, I got two shots, five or better. My rolling is so bad. There we go. Main battery is gone. Good job, guys. Thank you. Okay, from here? Nope. Cancel. You. Main battery. One tank. Five or better. I'll take it. Good job. Okay. Now. You with the treads. Up to eight damage. Probably not going to get any. Now oh, there's a little bit. That's going to be what? Two treads. Okay. So two treads. Not many, but... Better than none. Alright, let's try this guy. Treads from this one. Lonely GV. Potential two. Didn't happen. You... Main battery. Please. Yes. Awesome. And you again with treads. Possible six damage. Nope. Didn't do it. But now these two super heavies can harass this guy. I might have to break one off and bring him over here. I'm just going to be able to follow him and get shots off of that super heavy. So... So that could work. I don't see any benefit to breaking any roads or anything, so I guess we're going to end phase. And now move GEVs. Do we want to move some GEVs? I don't think so, except for to pull them back into the city here and lay wait for that guy. We do still have to take the treads off these guys, and they are still going to be hot putting it towards the sea. So. Uh, it might be time to try our overrun issue. This guy can still move. Yeah, let's pull him back as well. I don't, just because they're going to overrun. Alright, comes you, Mr. Nightfall. Alright. We're going to have to chase these dudes pretty good here. And I didn't think he'd be able to get in range, but I guess he did. Did we lose somebody here? Yeah, disabled by attack. So far, that whole shelter in the city thing isn't really working all that well for me. Uh, let's see. It would be worth moving these super heavies over here and trying to take out his main battery. Yeah, let's do that. Try to take out his main battery if that works. We'll go to work on shreds again. Now these guys, we're, we really do need to get in front of them or overrun them. We're going to lose one GEV for this if we do it. Infantry will just get toasted though. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> <coughs> Never mind. What I'm going to do is just try to get him up here and take out this guy. Take out his main battery at least. We don't need to go that far forward though. Nope. Cancel. You there. Okay. And now these guys can fire where they are. But is there any point in me getting ahead of them? Sorry, it's taking me a little bit to decide what to do here. I've only got two GEVs on this pile. There is no point in trying that overrun tactic there. So let me pull him out to here so he can get a fire on either one of these. We've got firing on either one of those guys there. Infantry is just going to get creamed if they go for it. But 
But you know what? No guts, no glory. I mean, these guys got to get used, right? And they're not going to make it convenient for me. So, I guess we'll do it that way. They're going to get toasted next turn. But hopefully they can take off a tread or two. Okay. So, that is it. We're still in movement phase. Alright, that's fine. I just want to make sure I don't end my fire phase accidentally. I would like to take one movement point off of this guy, which means we need to get six points of damage off of him. And that is going to be hard, but let's try. Okay, there's a start. That's not a good one. That's not a good one. That's not a good one. So, you have... Wait a minute, didn't one of those hit? Two treads to PFGV. Why don't you have any treads gone? Oh, you do, you're just not showing... Well, that's annoying. Alright. Try that. Good lord, man. Roll! Alright. See what our infantry can do. We're not gonna get four damage, I don't think, but it would be nice if they did. Nope. And no. Bloody hell. Okay, there's one. So they're both still movement three. We definitely want to take this off. I'm gonna go for five or better there. There we go. Okay, main battery is gone. That's pretty good. Let's go for your treads. I'm gonna just use these two guys for your treads. That's a no. And a no, okay. I thought I had turned up the animation speed, but I guess I hadn't done. All right, this guy. I'm just going to try to pound him if I can. Can't tell what happened. Uh, six treads total? Does that put you in a move too? It does, okay. Well, that's a start. These two I'm worried about though. They've got a move too, so one, two, one, two, one, two. Well, they won't come through the swamp, so... Three turns most. Oh, they're, they're moving three too, anyway. So that's... That's me being dumb. How far down can you guys move? I'm gonna bring him down here so they can come around that road next time. And now these guys. What am I gonna do with them? I would like to pull them... All I have to do is pull them back out of range of that guy. And actually, I could probably put them in range of these guys if I wanted to. Why don't I do that? Why don't I put a couple there, too? These are our main issue right now. We need to make sure that we stop these guys. And that's going to be it. Well, actually, you still have a movement left? Oh, yeah, you can go back up the road, but we don't want that. Okay, more fracking ogres have appeared. And they move like the wind now, sadly. And these are the damn infantry. Well, bad as it is, I'm going to move them over here. Hang on. You're the guy with the movement that needs to go. So let's just do that. GEVs. Um, could try this overrun thing. I don't think I want to. 
Now, do I leave these super heavies to deal up there? I can't, right? I have to bring them down here. I have to try to stop these guys. And the only way to do that is to get there and try to pound this guy right here and get his move down. Oh, this guy's only got one more, two more moves before he's in the ocean, too. Oh, none of this looks good to me. Kid, let's try this GUV overrun thing. Let's just add in all the other GUVs that can do it. And we'll, we go right into the overrun. So he rammed one and destroyed him right away. Let's try this. We should get a... I think we get like a couple fire phases at him. Because he doesn't have a weapon. So there go two treads. No treads. Uh, there's two more, I think. And no more. Okay, do we get another fire phase? Oh, that's a ramming phase. I don't want a ramming phase. Yeah, I want a fire phase. Okay, possible eight damage. Just a couple more to knock him down a notch would be nice. Come on. That's no. That's a no. Come on, guys. There we go. He is now speed two, and we get another fire phase. Beautiful. Okay, this works pretty well, actually. If I can knock him down to speed one, that will sure would be nice. I don't think it's going to happen, but... Alright, come on. I keep putting my mouse over here like it's going to give me some additional information. It is not... Nope. Alright. And still our move phase, right? So can we move out now? Oh, we can overrun again? Well, what the hell? We're gonna lose another one. But I get two more shots at him. Please give me some good rolls, though. Please? <laughs> Please? Can I have a good roll? Apparently not. I do not wish to ram a target, thank you, but I will take another fire phase. Come on, guys. Six damage. All hit. All hits. Okay, there's one hit. And another hit. Okay, that's four treads. And we have another fire phase. So come on, just two more. Two more, please. And this guy will not be a consideration. Okay. Come on. You do it. You will do it. You will not do it. Alright. You will not do it. Should I spend all of my GVs on this guy? I do have eight more coming. I don't think I can. I think I have to... Okay, I don't want to do that. What I'd like to do is move. Yeah, let's move just here. Let's pull him back. Let's pull the infantry. How far can you guys go? Not far enough. Let me think about super heavies. I'm just going to put the super heavies as close as, as I can to this guy. I'm really counting on our reinforcements being able to do something about those guys. Or me being able to knock him down to speed one with this go around. Could potentially disable him, but I don't know. You guys do not have enough move to get down here. You guys, we need to decide what to do. What would be worthwhile? They're not going to be able to fire on this guy, but they could next turn if I move him over here. He could potentially go here and attack me right away. But you know what? It might distract him. I'm going to try it. I don't want these infantry to be useless just because I didn't try to employ them. Okay, most important first, and that would be you, because, well, both of you are at the coast next turn, so...
Potentially six damage to Trex. We got two rolls here. Did that do it? That took him to two speed. That is wonderful. Well, let's try to take you to two speed with this other super heavy. Please. Yes. Yes, okay, these guys are both two speed. So, this guy's closer to the water. Let's see what we can get out of him. Potential seven. Oh my goodness. Nice job, infantry. They did a pretty good job, but not good enough, unfortunately. And these are what? They, oh, these are Miranda infantry. So, potentially four damage. Okay, that got you down to nine. We're pretty close to getting those two guys down to one, but not close enough, unfortunately. See if we can do this with these guys. Can we get you? Yes. Maybe. Yeah. Totally. He's down to move one. That's beautiful. Okay, what about you? Can we please just disable you totally here? Uh, nope. But we did get him down to move one. Alright, you know, best I can hope for, I think. Now, we got GEB movement. Uh, go for an overrun again with this guy? Try to shut him down totally? I don't think so. I don't think we do. Let's see how far they can get. I'm gonna bring them down here because potentially they can catch up to these guys if they need to. I'm hoping they can get across that water and the swamp next turn, if need be. But we don't know for sure. Now, is anybody else? Hmm. I can't. I can't really overrun. You know, I just can't. But what I can do is stick one there and stick one there. He's going to have to go through us to get to the ocean. And they may well do it. I don't think they can go... Well, they might try to go over that swamp. I don't know. Okay. When do we get our fracking reinforcements? Oh, here they are. Deploy reinforcements. Derp. I'm like, what? Where do they go? Up here. You guys are both there. What I'll do is put them right here. How many of these do we have here? What can I tell? I, I just can't even tell. There's five, are there really? I don't know why I thought we were getting eight, but okay, we got six. Can we do... No, we cannot do an overrun. But we can get everybody in range to try to take off their main batteries. And that'll be their first mission. Let me break up these stacks a little bit. We will be able to pull back out, so I'll, I'll stay there for now. Now you... I'm just going to... We've got six treads left. We will eventually get that guy with just one. So I'm going to put him in front like that, and then I'm going to head over this way to try to work on any of those guys that need working on. And you know, I'm just going to include the infantry in this little assault here. They may get killed next turn if we can stop him, but uh, who knows. All right, uh, what are we doing here? Can these GVs do anything? They cannot. They cannot get over here. Ram it! I thought they would be able to hop that river there. I totally botched it with those guys. Well, um. we could try to overrun this guy. I don't think we have to try to overrun. Let's just get them in range. Uh, you can't get in range of those guys to help work on their guns, unfortunately. 
So I'm just gonna... Let me just put him there. Probably done, but... Should put him on the road, huh? Yeah, quite possibly. Okay. Super Heavy, you guys have to stop these fellas right now. Put him here. Infantry... You got nine treads, you got eight treads. Uh, let's put him here and have him work on this guy. Oh my goodness. Alright, is there anybody else left to move? Anybody I forgot? I don't think so. In phase, let's work on these guys because they're our biggest threat at the moment. Start with the furthest one, please. Can you just roll good for me? Okay, that's not bad. We definitely need to try to take this guy down, so let's do that. Nope, and... Nope, you bastard. Okay. Infantry. Oh, just everybody pile in there. Possible seven damage. Come on, infantry. You can do this. Okay, there's one, there's two. Uh, three treads. Yeah, he's down to move one. Beautiful. Okay. Now, can you guys help me out here? Possible four damage. Yes. And no. Alright, but he is down to three treads and he's only got a move of one, so he's not going to be able to get away this turn, anyway. I think we might be able to get this with these guys. Come on, guys. We're all good. No? No. Alright. Well, that didn't work out real well. I can't attack over here. Why can't I attack over here? Lot of bites. All right. Well, say goodbye to your. Actually, hang on. Let's cancel that. Well, let's have the infantry do it and see how they do. And if they do well enough, then I'll. Uh... That's gonna be a no. no. I don't know. They did pretty good. Three treads left. Okay. Let's go with the Mark One. And the super heavy, and try to finish him off. Bam, you're done. Right? Yes, he is done. But unfortunately, these two, I didn't get to contact them with my, um, with my GEVs. Dang it. That really bites. Is it worth the overrun? And is this worth the overrun, for that matter? No, it's not, because they'll ram and they'll get that ramming phase up front. I'm gonna try this. This is probably just ill-advised, but I'm gonna try it. They've only got one battery. Okay, so he takes a shot and a ram, I think, and we still get four shots at him. Two to one on that turret. Did we get it? Yes. Okay, we got his main battery. That's beautiful. I'm not going to ram the target. And now we get another fire phase on him. Let's try some more tread damage. Come on, pick up the pace up here, man. This animation speed increase doesn't seem to work much in here. Still pretty slow. Got no treads off that time. We've got another fire phase, though. You know what? I don't know. I might keep doing this. We'll, we'll see. Okay, that's no treads. Seems like it's slowing down. No treads. Some treads. And some more treads. So that's four. I'm going to try it again and lose another GEV. This is pretty crucial, you know? This is pretty crucial. It'll only get me down to three GVs, but I'm going to get six shots at his treads again, and it could take him down to speed two, so let's go for it. If I can roll well. There we go. That should take him to speed two. There's two more on. 
and none there. But I'm gonna get another fire phase. Oh, no, that's a ramming phase. No, no ramming, thank you. Kinda pointlessly to dash yourself on the shore of this thing. Okay, we got a three. We got a one, and how about you? What do you got? A one. That was great. Okay, but we got another fire phase. Come on. These ogres are like cockroaches, man. Four. Come on. Four. Couldn't we just... Taking him to speed one would have just been magical, but that didn't happen. Oh boy, I almost feel like doing it again. But let's not do that. We've got one disabled GV over there. I can't really move him anywhere. So... I'm just gonna leave them. These guys, is there any point to bringing them down? They can't really go down, can they? Oh, they can. Yes, please, thank you. Pull them down to here. And we'll try to take these guys out next turn. These GVs are gonna stay exactly where they are. And are we going to do anything else? No, I don't think we're going to do anything else. I'm worried about this stack. There they go. <laughs> okay, you've done the overrun. Oh, boy. This isn't going to work. Max 2 damage. Nope, that didn't happen. And he's going to ram. We're going to lose the GV. Or what? I don't know. The music's bugging out. Oh, I'm not ramming. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. Alright, he's destroying infantry up here. Of course he is. And now, let's see. You've got the main battery still? No, you've got a main battery still. You're down to move two. You're move three. You're move one. I'm not too worried about you. I'm mostly worried about these guys, of course. guy only has one tread. Alright, let's move the infantry up to work on this guy. Man, the music's really bugging out over here. You know, I'm gonna turn down the music. Sorry, guys. Uh, that's doing a little weird. Where the heck is options? There it is. And audio, and let's just turn down the music volume, because it's freaking out on us. And go back in. Okay, that's better. All right, what to do with these GEVs? Do I trust my heavies that they can actually make this happen? I gotta. I gotta. And sounds like the audio wasn't the only thing kind of bugging out. You know, let's overrun and throw... Rack. We could throw everything in there. I'm not going to throw the Super Heavies in. I'm just going to throw the GVs in. Let's try that overrun on this guy. We're going to lose one, but then we're going to get a lot of fire phases to take out his three remaining treads. Let's try this. Come on, you can do this for me. No. And probably a no, right? Yeah, of course. No ramming, please. Thank you. Uh, but I will take these additional fire phases to try to please get two dice to roll over five. Five or better. Come on, can you do it? Can you do it for me? Okay. One more. One more. No, but we do get another fire phase. One die in three. <laughs> there we go. Alright, he is done. Good deal. Okay, we are not going to... Let's just end our phase here. He can't do anything. And can you guys actually move there? Oh, you can. Ooh, no. No, let's not do it. We'll just take the shot. I think we can get that guy with the one. Uh, now, let's see what we can do up here. We're not going to do any more movement with those guys. You guys can move, though. You're, uh, we only have two GVs left over here. Let me bring them 
One to one, two to one. Okay, you're three, three. Let's bring them down here. Try to get them out ahead of these guys. Again, you're two, two, you're three, three, and you still have your main battery. All right, I want to make sure that main battery goes away. I'm going to put you in the city there. And I'm going to bring you as far over as you can get, which isn't very far right now. Can I get on a road? No. All right. Come over. Infantry, please get out of that area because you're just going to get slaughtered over there. And is there anything else to do? No. Okay, let's go for firing here. We need to remove a whopping six treads from this guy. I don't know why I thought it was just one. Let's go. Okay, there's one, two, three. Uh, okay, I lost track, but yeah, only three. And holy hell, we ought to be able to do this, right? Come on. There's there's two more. So you're down to one tread. Something weird's going on here. This GV is selected oddly. Not sure exactly what that was all about. There we go. You are done, sir. Um, you know, there are other people over here that can't do anything, so why don't I just uh, throw in... Destroy some of these infantry killers that are hanging out on this guy. Mm, can we just do one battery at it? Three a better target destroyed, I'll take it. And here again. You can use the right battery. Nope, didn't get it. Okay, so he's going to kill a couple of our infantry over here next turn. All right, you're moving one. I'm not worried about you right now. You've got your main battery. I am worried about you. Let's try to take this main battery out with a super heavy, five or better. God. Bless. That's not going to get it, is it? I just don't feel like that's going to get it. That will give us a four or better. Let's make one attack at five or better, and then we'll try it. And we'll try another attack with uh, three or better from these guys. But we don't have to now. Or five or better. Whatever. I'm just babbling now. And is there anything else we can attack here? No. Okay. In phase. And now we have GVs again that can move. So I think what we'll do is... Well, if I know where to put these guys, I don't know where these guys are going to head. Let's just bring them. Let's just bring them up. Man, sorry the audio's bugged, guys. Don't know. Don't know what's up. Let's bring you around here. You can try random me if you want. Did I get that main battery? Yeah, I got the main battery, so we're good there. Hopefully, our Super Heavy can try to get in range a little bit here in a minute. Oh, crap. Okay. Well, you guys did a good job. We'll go for treads. But one of you is toast. Oh, there's some. Oh, boy, the audio is really freaking out. Now, we're not going to... I know I'm not going to... Thank you. We'll try for more treads, though. Oh, yes, that took you down on speed notch, didn't it? Okay, that takes him down to two. And we got another shot at him. Take that. Come on. Oh, and again, nice. I am very happy about that. And we get another fire phase. I, I can't keep track of why we get so many fire phases, but I'm willing to accept it. And again, what happened to my luck there? Holy crap, Doc. Okay, he just toasted some infantry over here. That's fine. That's fine. It's our move phase, so... What the heck? Move just as close as we can, I guess. Super heavy. Can get within range of this guy. And are you our move two guy? Yeah, okay, you were the move three guy. You're move two, that's fine. 
Infantry. Well, I'll try to get them over there. I don't think they're really going to be able to do it. Now, what's here? Three GVs, which cannot really get across this river here, but we can bring them up within range, at least. Let me just double check that you guys, you know, they have no movement left. That is beautiful. Um, I'm happy to just bring this super heavy up to here. That'll put you in range of that, right? And put me in range of the lead one there. And then we'll just bring this infantry somewhere where they'll eventually be useful but aren't sitting next to an ogre with fully active anti-personnel batteries. And what do I have in here? I have a GEV in here. Well, let's pull him out. And let's end phase. So you've got 2-2 two, two with 8 treads. You've got 1-1 one, one with 4 treads. And you've got 2-2 two, two with 10 treads. Let's start on the first guy. Let's see. That's potential 2. That's possibly all of his treads. If we hit them all, we're not going to, but... Did hit two, though, and that took him down to one movement. I'm willing to accept that. Let's work on this guy, if we can get him. Let's try that. That's a no. And a no. Okay. Well, still got one super heavy over here, which could potentially take him down. It did not. Uh, that's fine. Can we still fire on you from somebody? Is that a road? That's a road. No, I don't want to attack the road. Thank you. But, you guys, let's just try one of these guys on him. Oh, yes. Uh, how did we do there? We took you down to one tread. Okay, we'll leave you limping. And let's try you with there. Come on. You could really do with, yeah, like that. Two down to one tread, one guy down to seven treads, and that is all we have. And we actually have a fair bit of infantry or units on the field. So, I think we're doing okay. Let me just make sure that I cannot attack any of these guys here real quick before I move on. No, yeah, I thought so. Okay, well, in phase, you guys can move a max of one. Oh, I got GEV movement now. Uh, could overrun and go for the final kill on a couple of these guys. I can't quite get to that guy, unfortunately. These guys are just a one hit, one kill, but you know what? The odds are really good of that. Let's do it. We're going to lose one. Let's take on you. All we got to get is one hit here. And then we can just bail out. Come on. One hit is all I need. Nope. Didn't get it. It is fire phase, not ramming phase. Okay. Hard to tell sometimes. I tend to not look at interface as much as I ought to. Ah, there we go. Okay, so you are done, and we can end the phase. Do we have another fire phase here? Is that what this is? They didn't have a target, maybe, because all the treads were gone? Okay, that's fine. We'll finish out this fire phase. Okay, sure. I'll take an extra fire phase. Alright, we're done with that. Now, but the question is, what I'm wondering here, is can you guys really move there, too? Yes, you can. We might be able to take this guy down to just... Uh, we might be able to get rid of him once and for all. Let's see. Come on, give us five. Give us five. Yes. Okay, he is out of the picture, so we only have one guy left. We are done, sir. Thank you. I'm going to just skip that fire phase and let them do whatever the heck they want. Yeah, you don't get to fire because you suck. Uh, let's see. Can we just add insult to injury and put some infantry on this fella? Yeah. Do that. Uh, we won't do another overrun, though. But I do want to make sure that the super heavy is in range and infantry can come along and laugh. 
they're just going to stand in the background and say one 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 at this ogre here. Now you can't move, right? Okay, no, you can't move. All we got is you, and you know what? Everybody, get involved, please, and just remove all of this bastard's treads. If we can't do it with that, then yeah, man, I'm just giving up. Okay, there's two good rolls. And combat log is bugged, unfortunately. And there we go. Finally done. Okay, I'm very surprised by that, uh, but I'm very happy with it, too. And I will see you guys next time around. Thanks again to everybody for commenting, and in particular to Grant Opinion for all of his expert advice. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.